How is it going everyone? We are gonna update and repair this Xperia phone Android. This method works for all the Xperia Sony phones. The first thing that you should do is that you have to search Xperia Companion Download. Then in the first website, there is two versions of the software, one for Windows and another one is for Mac. And after you download and install it, the software icon is look like this. And actually the software is very easy to use and also is very user friendly. So that would be very easy tutorial, but I think this would be good if we go it step by step together through the process. The first one, you have an option of software update, but uh, I do not want to use this one. I want to repair the Android of my phone because my phone is working very slowly. It is not only repair for Android, but also it installed the latest version of the Android to it too. The first step, as it mentioned, is that of course you should connect your phone to the computer. Alright, it's also mentioned that first I should unlock my phone and allow access to the phone. You should choose an option that's mentioned transfer files. One of the another important things is that it mentioned that your phone battery level should charge up to 50%. Based on your internet speed, it takes different time that the software is downloaded. And also you can see it detects my devices, which is Xperia Sony XA2. At this stage, my phone automatically shuts down. One thing that you should consider is that all the content on your device is going to be deleted, such as contact, messages, and photos. But the content on the SD card is not erased, but I already removed the SD card, so I am not worried about this one. By clicking on the next, you see that you are going to the final stage that is mentioned. It is going to prepare your devices. And actually the process was very quick. It takes about five minutes for me or something like that. So it mentioned that the Xperia software is repaired. So right now you should disconnect your devices and turn on your device. It also mentioned that the first startup after the repair, it takes uh, longer than usual. Right now you can click on the done section on the software and then you can disconnect your phone. Then I should turn it on, which actually I am hope it turns on. I don't know why it's not working. <laughs> all right, here we are. So that's all, that's very easy. It also repairs your Android and all update the devices. And here is the first page that you are gonna see, which you are going to choose the language and then you can use your phone. Thank you very much. I hope that would be helpful for you. And I'm going to see you next time. Bye-bye.